today is the day that our wood is getting delivered. This is going to eventually turn into our fence for the garden. I got her that that mug for Christmas. You did get me that mug for Christmas. You know what yours says? Always be happy, but not like the like like bee. It's actually like bees, like the bugs. Yeah, the bumblebees. <laughs> It's perfect for the garden. Yeah. <laughs> Are you trying to plant those? <laughs>
Good morning. on my hair <laughs> obviously I've been in the garden so um, I'm looking at my beans that I planted within the past week um, and I see that some of them are struggling let me show you what I'm talking about okay so I just kind of peeled away the mulch which I don't think I'm gonna do next time until the seedlings start popping through but this one looks decent this one looks really white and just not healthy so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to plant a new seed right here and I'm just going to watch these two and see how they come out. Um, this one, let's see, I'll be very gentle. That one looks good. This was a transplant because I had started some inside and the seed that it was in here was mush. I don't even know. I think I just tossed it. So I don't have that one anymore. We have one right here that is looking decent. This might be another one that I might pop in a seed right next to it and then just see which one does better and then thin from there. This one's doing good. Look at it's got its seed cap on right there. This one's doing wonderful. And this was another transplant. So before I put in these seeds I was talking about, I actually have them in a little bit of water. I'm gonna see how that process works. I didn't do that the first time. I'm gonna check in over here. This one looks great nothing is here I don't know if I forgot to plant there or I just couldn't find what I planted or something dug it up either way need a new seed here this one is not looking like super unhealthy but it's also missing one of its first leaves um, you can see this one's a transplant sorry I have a bug on me um, these little buggers down here it's missing one of those so I don't know how this guy's gonna do so I'm actually gonna pop in a seed right next to him 
And then here's two transplants because those seeds kind of went to mush. This one's doing okay. This one, I'm gonna actually help it out a little bit and remove the seed cap. That one looks okay. This one's working its way through. I'm gonna help it a little bit because for some reason my soil's a little clumpy. And then here we go, we have another one right here. So I wanna talk to you a little bit more about this. I am both a little bummed out, but also a little excited about this process. Um, I'm bummed out because some of my seeds went to mush, but I'm excited about the experiment that will happen now where I get to see if um, by planting new seeds right now, if I'll get some sort of succession um, planting succession harvest out of this where like maybe one week I have a big um, haul and then the next week another big haul. Really anytime you make a mistake in the garden you can call it an experiment uh, which is another reason why I'm falling in love with gardening. <laughs> if you can see behind me uh, we started getting the posts in for the garden fence. Uh, that needs to go on very soon because I'm going to start moving. Well, I've already got a couple plants out here but I'm going to start moving my tomatoes out here within the next week or so. So hopefully we get the fence done in time. It's really a time crunch as far as the fence goes right now. And I haven't done an update on my garlic. I'm gonna show you where that's at right now. As for a garlic update, this right here is like my tester area where I pull garlic once a month just to see the progress. And this line here is the real deal. It's all looking really great. This is elephant toe garlic. I also have elephant toe garlic planted over here. With the exception of this, I believe this one's a white German, so this one will have a scape at some point. For the rest of the middle here is elephant toe. And then these were the transplant um, experiment <laughs> because the garden bed up front failed uh, late winter. And so I transplanted these late winter and they seem to be doing really good. These are, are all white German. Last thing here, I did plant some radishes about a week ago, sometime within the past week, and they are coming up lovely.